Home. No. Hello there. What? What's up, my NSAVs? Welcome to my channel. So, today I'm going to be reacting to Gravity Falls Season 1, Episode 14, Bottomless Pit. Uh, I can only assume that this episode is going to be about a bottomless pit. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Before we get into it, make sure to like and subscribe for more videos. Go ahead and check me out on my social media accounts where I post art and other cool stuff. If you want to see the full version of this reaction, go ahead and click that Patreon link down below. And now, without any further ado, Let's get into it. In this land of ours, there are many great pits, mm -hmm. but not more bottomless than the bottomless pit, which, as you can see here, is bottomless. You knew about this the entire time? Oh, Why are we here again? Yeah. To dispose of things that we don't want. So long, Mystery Shack suggestion cards. Goodbye, creepy what? love letters from little Gideon. Ugh, <laughs> die! Die! <laughs> it's just my personal box of mysterious secrets. Nothing worth wondering about. <laughs> I wonder about it. Goodbye forever! Uh -huh. well, I guess we'll never know. Unless you fall in it. Uh, some sort of invisible pushing force! Wind. <laughs> You're gonna fall. Almost. 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 Yeah. Hey, buddy. I got you right here. Oh, let's see if the whisper is any different. Uh, that sounds a little different. Hold on. It is different! That one is different! Tell me it's not! That is fucking different. I'm gonna have to uh, reverse it in editing just to be sure. I feel like it's different. Yeah, that's definitely different. That is different, and I'm gonna find out what it is in editing. It really is bottomless. So how do you get out? Well, it looks like we're down here for the long haul. How did you Who discover wants to see this? Some card tricks? <laughs> Ta da! <Come> on. <laughs> Maybe we should pass the time by telling stories. I'll tell you a story. Really? A story I'd like to call voiceover. Oh, God. What is this? Ready? Hey, Uncle Stan, ever kissed a pig before? I'm not going to answer that question. Guys, it's guys, a yes. It's just hard to focus on what you're saying with that squeaky puberty voice wow. you got there. My what? It's nothing to be ashamed of, Dipper. You're he might have gotten bit by a snake. What a crack so much we've already made a techno remix out of it. Nice to meet you. My name's Dipper Pines. Nice to meet you. Do I really sound like that? Y'all are messed up. Why are they so mean to Dipper? Hey, I remember you. Your robot almost killed me. Come here. Follow me into this Oh, so this was like the second time you ever saw him? Got it. Thanks. Come morning, you'll sound like a new man. If you I was like, you're just gonna drink some weird green shit that some random old man that you just met made? Cool. In a graveyard? I mean, junkyard. Good morning, Dipper. Oh. I did it. I did it. Now I have a new voice. No, stop. It's horrible. <laughs> I knew boys' voices changed, but this is weird. Mm -hmm. Weird and bad. Mm -hmm. Mabel, this is the best thing Mabel. that ever happened. Hello? Hello, this is the President of the United States of America. I'm calling to tell you. Stop. <laughs> what? Who is this? Mabel, no like. No. Elijah, no like either. Kill it! Yeah. Kill it with fire! Everybody you said kill it! Kill it with fire! <laughs> you guys all made fun of my old voice. I thought you'd like the new one. No. Dude, at least before you sounded like a real person. Now you sound like some kind of weird commercial dude. I'll find <laughs> sure. Stan. Grunkle Stan? Where are you, Grunkle Stan? Huh? I know that voice anyway. You're the guy who prank called me earlier. <sighs> there's a prank caller on the loose. Let's get it. Really? There's a prank caller on the loose? Wow. Yes. Chase this 12-year-old boy for being a prank caller. Love it. That's me. That's me. me. I've never heard anything like it. Remix over. You're ready for your new voice? Oh, it's red it's now. Uh -uh. Don't do it. <clears throat> hey, guys. 
Dipper! Oh, dude, you're back! <laughs> so what did you do with the rest of that potion? Yeah. I dumped it in Stan's coffee. Any of you kids seen my girdle? Where my girdle at? <laughs> <laughs> what? What's so funny? I'm Grunkle Stan! Kids laughing. Laughing at that Grunkle. Laughing at that Grunkle. Hey, guys. Is this just gonna, like, take the entire episode in this pit? Everyone spin! No. So everyone's just gonna share stories in this is really great pinball story. bottomless pit. Okay. Have you ever tried wow. maybe just tilting the machine? I don't know, dudes. Is it breaking the rules? Like against the rules? Yeah. Next to the rules. Tilt, tilt, tilt. Nope. Don't do it. Don't do it. It's a creepy. Tilt, tilt, partner. Tilt, partner. Tilt. Is it? Taunt, taunt. Taunt. Right, <laughs> Never trust anything in that place, I swear. <laughs> Are you in the pinball machine? Oh, God. That's not fun. You're going to have a giant silver freaking ball coming after you. If this is a dream, I never want to wake up. I think you might want to at some point. Be See? Well, take this! Do you have to go that far with it? And this! Ow, it hurts! I wish this was working better. Oh, dude! Zeus! Oh, it hurts! I told you it's gonna be a problem! I think, guys. I'm trying, but it's hard with that gorgeous pinball wench distracting me. Wow. <laughs> oh, are either of you good at jumping up and down and making annoying noises? Yep. <laughs> My time. Come. Right, Own it. Go, yeah, Mabel's got this in the bag. Some mate right here. Distraction! Distraction! Let me see where this is going. What's going on? Just press the switch already. Okay, so I was gonna do that, but I've been thinking. According to this, turning off the power erases the high score permanently. That score is like my one big life account. Oh, don't, Zeus, I swear. Get oh, ready to meet shit. your maker, kids. My maker is Ballway Games in Redmond, Washington. Wow, the little fun. Bro! Please, turn it off! Well, how do you, okay, so turning it off just makes you guys leave? My high score? You didn't even earn that high score, dude. You'll still have the high score if nobody else is on that list. Got it. Sorry you had to lose your high score. That's okay. I got a new life accomplishment now. Saving you dudes. Uh. <laughs> you think that pinball wench will call me? No, I don't think so. My Grunkle Stan wins the football ball. Did you really? Or did you cheat as well? <laughs> Here's your football winning trophy, Mr. Pug. I feel like this is a lie. <laughs> it's not real. I love you, Stan. Boo. Yeah. Come on. Let's do it. What? That story was great. I even threw in a talking robot for the kids. Yeah, yeah. No. I'm gonna a story called Truthing. Ugh. I'm gonna teach this bear to drive. Dude. And the yellow light means speed up. What? Oh. Where do they even come up with these ideas? Doctors assigned me a seeing eye bear to drive me to the hospital. In case That's great. That's a great excuse. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Then where's your doctor's note? It's right here inside my jacket. <laughs> ah, there you go. Mm -hmm. Dr. Medicine. Well, I can't argue with Dr. Medicine. Don't you know lying is always wrong? Mabel, when you get to be my True age, sake. you'll learn that Hey, has anyone seen my plate of spaghetti? <laughs> no. Man, but I could go for some spaghetti right no, now. I'll Maybe you should check Dipper's journal, oink, oink. Oh, hey, oink, one more Mabel. Time. Oink, oink. Waddles, you genius. Don't mess with that the book. With the deep truth teeth, which force upon the wearer an inability to lie. Hmm. And it hurts the more you lie. Why are they gold? This is not good. Uh, what's going on? This is the plot twist. Wait, it said something about the plot twist on his thing. The plot twist. Oh. I thought we would give away something about uh, this show. On? What happened to Dipper's spaghetti plate? I ate it because I have little to no concern for other people's possessions or emotions. There it is. What do you do in secret every day during your lunch break? Usually I spend the hour aggressively scratching myself in places I shouldn't mention. 
Now I'm going yeah. to avoid making. Hey, everybody! Look at this guy's abnormal and unattractive face! Oh. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. That was not nice. I'm so sense. sorry. I'm so sorry. Is this all there is? Is life just some kind of horrific joke without a punchline? That we're all just biding our time until the sweet, sweet release of death? <laughs> it's morbid. I think I have a growth forming on my back. Just wanted to be honest with you guys. I can't take it anymore, man. Yeah. You mm -hmm. have to take those teeth out of his mouth. See, I lied to you. In addition, I've been parking in handicapped spaces, shoplifting fireworks, and smuggling endangered animals across multiple state lines. Also, you're fat. Sir, I have we to can lie to the authorities. Our friend Uncle Stan is. is. Uh, Table. <laughs> So you did the one thing that you were so against. Hey, you all right? I can't believe I lied. Yeah, I... Mabel? We have to find a place to get rid of these. Oh! And I never saw that box full of magical teeth again. Oh, I dirt. knew that box was going to be about something. Uh, Can you guys just like climb right out? Like maybe just floating there? Guys, do you see that? It's the top. You're going to be flung right back oh, out the top. The top. It probably like you just float for a little bit and then get shot right back out. Yeah. Where? Yep. Where are we? We came right back out the top. So what else has come back up? And I don't think any time has passed. It must be some kind of wormhole. Yeah, dude. That sounds sciencey enough to be true. But yeah, nobody would believe you unless you made it like an attraction or something. Oh god. Keep to ourselves. Agree. Make it an attraction. They'll be fine. That's how it ends? Okay, so how long until you get thrown back up? Also, where's my code? Yeah, ooh, it's nothing but numbers! Ooh, that's interesting. Okay, nothing but numbers this time. Okay, okay. This is stupid. You know what? That's the bottomless pit for you, Stan. Um, wow, okay, that was good. Interesting bottomless pit. I wonder if that will come back to play in a future episode. Maybe. I don't know. I guess we'll see. That was funny, though. Uh, made for, uh, for another good episode to make me laugh. Looking forward to more, as always, and looking forward to learning more about the mysteries and stuff like that. So I'll uh, keep staying tuned for that. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. Go ahead and check me out on my social media accounts where I post art and other cool stuff. If you want to see the full version of this reaction, go ahead and click that Patreon link down below. I thank you guys so much for tuning in and I'll see you next time. Bye!